What's up YouTube? This is your boy Josh of Basic Value and for today I'm going to be teaching you how to create a play again button and a play again function in Scratch. So without further ado, let's get into this. First you want to create a sprite. Of course you choose the button one and then you choose this one. All right, let's just delete this one and you create this sprite right here with the text and the button. Now let's go to the code. So basically I have already coded it. So the first thing you want to do is um, I based it on the changes of my backdrop since this game already has um, a game over function. So when the backdrop switches to blue sky, you want to hide it because you're going to play. But when the backdrop switches to game over, you, ne you need the forever block and then the F block. So inside the F block, uh, let's just say you put lives in here, or time or whatever, because in my case, I used my score. So if score is equal to 100, then you want to show the play again uh, button. Then when it is clicked, when the sprite is clicked, you want to set the score to zero and then broadcast play again. After that, you want to go to the to the first sprite and then you want to use this one. When I receive play again, switch backdrop to blue sky too. So let's test it out if it really works. So basically my game is just a basic um, uh, chasing game wherein the, the cat chases the star and then when the cat hits the star, you gain a score. So basically, here's my game over screen. Then when you click the play again, you cannot play again. So that's how easy it is. Thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe. This is Josh of Basic Value. I'm going to be seeing you on the next one. Peace out.